The goals of the IAI strategic plan center on eight main areas. Poverty and equality, food security, water security, energy security, climate action, human health and well-being, biodiversity and ecosystem services, and clean air, water, and soil. The IAI promotes the co-creation of knowledge with scientists and other stakeholders to identify priority societal issues, propose research questions, carry out transdisciplinary research, and ensure that the information generated is useful, timely, and can be readily applied to address the needs of society. Since 1999, the IAI Directorate has organized 50 training events with 468 speakers and 1,187 participants. Its science program has supported 175 research projects with over 23 million US dollars in funding. As part of its efforts to promote equity, diversity and inclusion, special attention has been given to support early career researchers and small countries. O projeto Mapfire tem o objetivo de contribuir para a redução do risco de desastres associados a queimadas e incêndios florestais na Amazônia. Para atingir o nosso objetivo, integramos o avanço do conhecimento científico voltado para o entendimento dos riscos e quantificação dos impactos do fogo, tanto para os ecossistemas quantos prejuízos para as populações humanas. Além de ser o principal financiador do projeto Mapfire, o IAI forneceu todos os mecanismos necessários de adaptação para o uso do recurso durante o enfrentamento da pandemia de Covid-19. O IAI teve um papel fundamental na promoção e facilitação da integração dos pesquisadores e atores da sociedade nos diferentes países para fazer melhor uso dos produtos desenvolvidos por esse projeto. With support from the IAI, multinational research teams have worked across scientific disciplines addressing research questions that one country could not address alone to fill gaps in the collective understanding of both drivers of global change and their impacts. The capacity building efforts have contributed to strengthening research institutions and networks across the Americas, particularly in Latin America and the Caribbean. O impacto do Programa de Desenvolvimento de Capacidades do IAI ao longo dos 30 anos tem sido muito importante. O investimento inicial que o IAI fez em apoiar bolsas de doutorado e pós-doutorado nos anos 90 e 2000 foi fundamental. Os estudantes naquela época são hoje os profissionais, os pesquisadores que estão liderando a pesquisa das mudanças globais nos seus países e contribuindo também para fóruns internacionais importantes como o IPCC e o IBER. We had a project in Paraguay that was funded by the IAI in collaboration with uh, several um, private sector representatives in that country. Uh, the, the IAI has uh, the structure that we we started with the IAI requiring, in fact, it required uh, four countries to participate. I was representing the US, we had Paraguay, we had Bolivia, but uh, it was already uh, putting together a, a a structure that required a lot of uh, team building uh, in, in transdisciplinary, transdisciplinary approach by the fact that several uh, different people from different countries, they had different backgrounds. And, and I believe that this uh, was very helpful uh, because it helped us uh, see the same issue from very different angles. And IAI is one of the first organizations to truly adopt transdisciplinary research approaches to global environmental change challenges. So the training and capacity building programs have created opportunities for both researchers and decision makers to learn how to work together. And the results have been incredibly promising. Several national policies have been based on the work that the IAI researchers have provided after working with communities to understand the challenges that they faced. So IAI is part of a global network of funding agencies called the Belmont Forum that seeks to create opportunities to support 
transdisciplinary research to provide knowledge for understanding, mitigating, and adapting to global environmental change. This provides researchers in the Americas with the opportunity to work with their international counterparts from all over the world. And these opportunities are critical for sharing knowledge, developing networks that can help develop solutions to challenges that we face in the Americas, but that can also be transferred to other regions. <laughs>